we're here with Chef Ryan here at the Grand Wailea, and uh, I'm going to learn how to make some poke. It's going to be some kick-ass poke, let me tell you. So, what, what do I have to do to make some kick-ass poke? we got a beautiful uh, product here. we got some fresh ahi. we got a beautiful yellowtail. That's our yellowtail homachi. And here we got wonderful components here. we got fresh Maui onion. we got fresh ginger. Right now it's ramp season, so we got uh, fresh ramps, fresh calamansi. Calamansi is a cross between a lime and a lemon. Mm -hmm. Filipino lime, very nice. Then we have our sea asparagus you can throw in there. We have two different kind of ogos. We have the purple ogo in green. Has a nice little texture, very saltiness. And uh, some fresh avocado. We got shiso leaves you could add. A little bit of green onion and some ball. So basically I can mix any of these together and make my own sort of concoction, my own custom poke, if you Definitely. will, right? Definitely. All right, so I'll take a little bit of Ahi uh, tuna for sure. Is it good to mix the two? I would. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah All right. You get two different you textures, you get the sweetness. All right, I'm in there for that. Take a little bit of the onion here. Perfect. Definitely some ginger, I think. Uh, you got your ogo for the nice texture. Very nice. Oh, yeah. And the ogre. color at the same time. Yeah. Yes. That's looking good delicious. So far. Perfect. We're Excellent. good so far. And then if you like spice, we have the nice uh, sambal. For here we have our fresh uh, out of the garden, our Hawaiian chilies. Well, let's do the Hawaiian chilies for there sure. Just a little bit. Don't want to make it too spicy. And also we have a nice uh, toasted uh, macadamia in there. With a little bit of uh, Hawaiian sea salt in there to give a nice little texture. Mm. You always got to end it with seasoning. So here we have a beautiful uh, molokai. Molokai black salt. And we have our Hawaiian sea salt. Mm -hmm. And if you want, we just have our traditional sea salt right here. All right, let's mix this all together. Let's see what kind of chef I really am. Beauty. All right. All right. And if you always wanted to add a little more color, you could add some scallions, green onions, or the ranch. Okay. But right there, that looks delicious. Right there, let's do it. Here. My first attempt at poke, and I made it myself. Mm. Wow, that's fantastic. If you're looking for a dish that's refreshing, and really, really tasty. Make your own poke. Thank you very much, Chef. This sure. is absolutely fantastic. I'll take this recipe home and make my own homemade poke. If you enjoyed that video, make sure to subscribe to our channel.